Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness with Breast Cancer Answers. If you need a biopsy done of your breast, what's the preferred method? The answer is a needle biopsy. But then the question becomes, gee, Dr. Harness, how does that work? Hey, and hey, is it going to hurt? Well, before answering that question, let me take this opportunity to thank our sponsor, Breast Cancer Index. It's a test that may help women with estrogen receptor positive early stage breast cancer to decide with their doctors whether to extend or end anti-hormonal therapy after five years. If we discover a lump in the breast, either by physical examination, by mammogram, or by ultrasound, whatever the method, we want to biopsy it. And the preferred way of biopsying lumps in the breast is called a needle biopsy. Now, there are two types of needle biopsies. One's a very, very fine needle, similar to what they do for a TB test, if you will. And that's called a fine needle aspirate biopsy, FNA, fine needle aspirate. That gives us cells, and the cells can usually, we can usually tell whether the cells are benign or the cells are malignant. But what it doesn't give us is what we call the histology, more about the cancer, if you will, including the markers, estrogen receptor, progesterone receptor, HER2 new. So actually, the more preferred method for biopsying the, the breast is called a core needle biopsy. Now, if we look at the uh, inside of the pen, the little tube in here that's holding the ink, that's generally about the size of the cores that we're doing. It's like a good-sized piece of spaghetti, if you will. Uh, you need to make a little nick in the skin and then insert this uh, needle, usually attached to what's called a vacuum-assisted core biopsy device or perhaps a spring-activated device. You need to then advance that to where we want to do the biopsy and sample the tissue. Now, if you don't use local anesthetic, you bet it's going to hurt. But quite frankly, the little nick that's made in the skin is really minimal. And we always want to try and use a minimally invasive technique in order to establish a diagnosis, particularly of breast cancer, because, because then that allows us to do better planning for what the overall treatment will eventually involve. So the answer is... Core needle biopsy is the preferred method. That's called a core needle biopsy. Fine needle biopsies can be used but are not the preferred method. You want to have them done by a qualified breast surgeon or breast radiologist. Yes, it needs to be done under local anesthesia. And no, it shouldn't hurt very much at all if done properly. Let me take this opportunity now to thank our sponsor, Breast Cancer Index. To find out more about your treatment options beyond year five, just click the button and download our free list of 15 questions to go through with your doctor.